everyone, Wanderbot here, and welcome back to Darkest Dungeon. So, I realized in the last episode that I was kind of super cranky about this character. Not, you know... Um, let's see if it crashes. Okay. Uh, super cranky about the, the adjustments with the lion's roar. But I guess really it's not that big of a deal. Because honestly, the lion's roar changes don't generally affect me yet. Interesting. They don't. They really do not have her animations filled out. She doesn't even have the ability to. Um, she really doesn't even have the ability to climb ladders without looking different. Interesting. Okay. Well, that's cool. Let's see. Oh shoot! I can I can actually injure the statues with that. That is horrifying. I'm not entirely sure like how necessarily bad that's going to be. But they could cause some problems along the way. Okay, please, please be heavy punches. No, but it is useful. That is incredibly useful. Because now we actually do damage here. Good. Okay. Ooh. Whew. Okay, we got this under wraps. Yeah. Oh, you know what? I should have gone with wanted again. Eh, but then again, I did, I did wanted the last time. And actually, things I've learned about this game. Wanted is really useful as an early game boost. But after that, it's actually kind of bad. Because uh, the way this game handles item generation, by the time you make it to New Game Plus, you really do not want to be wanted. Uh, not not necessarily. I mean, you're probably going to get wanted anyway. But uh, you just don't want that ring because there are better rings that you're going to find along the way. Like, way better rings. Just hands down. And I actually found that quite surprising, honestly. Okay. Unfortunately, we're going to have to fight uh, Dickbag McBandit King. Uh, without, like, any good weapons. Oh, God. No bombs, no weapons. Oh, there he is. So, you know what? We're going on adventures for a second. I don't know. Oh, perfect. We can loop back around. Because currently, he's not going to fall in the water. We want him to come back up to us. We do get the fairy chick, though. Which is kind of an early game. I'm not entirely sure if I'm happy about it being there. But, you know what, whatever. Okay, so let's switch to the other side. Oh, shoot, we've got a... We've got a Shrine of the Shackled here. That could be useful. Did I say Darkest Dungeon? Damn it, people got... People got into my head again. Alright, this is not Darkest Dungeon, this is Vigante. It's been freaking... Yep, Wanderbot fan fiction, apparently. That involves... Birdcatcher entering my Darkest Dungeon. Alright, so you know what? I don't think he can hurt me. Underwater. Yeah! Oh, God. Well, no, he can. Turns out he absolutely can hurt me underwater. Well, it's okay. We've got the we've got the fairy chick. So it's actually probably best if I just fist him a bunch and then call it a day. Okay. So instead of just putting on this equipment and finding out it's cursed... Uh, let's see. No such luck. Improve, improved archery. Well, that's not good. If it lets me, I'm gonna... Well, turns out we have messed everything up. Well, okay, fine. Uh, let's see about the talisman. Looks like the talisman's okay. So we get mana... Wow, deja vu all over again. Well, you know what? Mana shield is great up until you get heal. And or have, like, enough defense that nothing does damage to you anymore. At which point, it's worthless. Okay, let's get up here. So, you know what? Oh, you know what? I'll make do. Th this run actually has a fair amount of potential. Okay, we just had to worry about that. Let's piss off the mimic. There we go. Money. Still not quite enough for anything particularly useful, but that said, eh, it's not terrible. Okay, so we'd have to worry about the arrow trap here. What the? Oh, God damn it! Browser's like, Shockwave player has has crashed on you, and it's just like, that's not useful in the slightest. All right, let's drop an arrow. Not have to worry about an arrow. And, of course, everything outside of my computer has decided to mess up miserably. Let's see if I can fix that. Shockwave. <laughs> Media player. No, Flash. This is like the worst thing ever. 
I cannot wait until the industry walks away from it as a standard. I can't even see chat at this point. Okay, there we go. Should be fine. Uh, let's see. So do we have any secrets here? None that I see. Well, we got one. Jeez, how do you even get to this one? There we go. Do I have anything useful in it, though? That is the question that I always must ask myself. Yep. Here's the problem. I don't... Oh, what? Oh. So it's already pressed down. Do not have to worry about it. There we go. Okay. Okay. <sighs> wow. Let's check the armor. Let's grab the fairy chick. We're going to be full health. A little bit pre preemptively, but as long as I have... As long as I have... I mean, this basic equipment, it's not great, but as long as I have it, it's probably going to push us forward a fair amount. Okay. So let's see how we're doing. Um, oh, shoot. The treasure room. Do not forget the treasure room. <laughs> Let's see if that's any good. Hey, if I can get if I can get the um Let's just tuck her there. No reason for her to come up with us. Um if I can get my hands on infinite jump really early on in the game, that would be really useful. No idea if I'm gonna get there though. Well, this is damn good. Four defense right off the bat is way useful. I don't think it's gonna prevent me from like too much damage, but still. That's going to help help me a fair amount here. Okay, and this is going to put us at 90 HP. Would have enjoyed sacrificing her instead just because, but at the same time, whatever. Okay. Doesn't look like they've changed butt stomp too much. Let's let's see if it, they changed the tick rate along here. Because that is one thing I didn't actually uh, bother checking because I was too salty. Okay, does not look like they changed the tick rate. Holy crap, I barely take damage here. That's extremely useful. Oh, this is... I mean, I'll be honest. This is... Oh. oh, hello. Oh, hello. That is incredibly useful. So, cool thing about pork chops now. Wander ignored your Patrick Star request. Wander will always ignore your Patrick Star request. I did not voice Patrick Star. God damn it, bird catcher. That is not the kind of... That is not the kind of rumors we spread here. Okay, so we got it. We got to worry about spikes now. What? Wait, what? I like took falling damage from going down a ladder. That was odd. I like sped down a ladder and then butt stomped and it's like you've taken damage. I gotta. Weird. I had to test that twice. That's bad. I'm. Definitely going to report that one, because I don't actually know if anybody... That was convenient. I don't know if anybody's actually run into that one. I mean, it's probably a noted bug, but that's actually still one of... The, that's actually one of the worst bugs I've seen in quite a while. Okay. Oh, let's just punch this guy to death. Unfortunately, because I don't have the boulder there anymore, it's actually going to make it a little bit harder. Okay. Sup? Nope, that didn't work. Trying to punch him. Trying to punch him real hard. Come on, let me punch ya. There we go. That actually worked comically easy. Okay, we're gonna have plenty we're gonna have plenty of leftover HP. So I am not gonna You know what? I wonder if super butt stomping just makes it so you take falling damage now. That's uh I gotta I gotta test it. Just so I don't make the mistake in a worse worse location. I hate testing, though. I hate testing in such a way... Wait. Perfect science position. Okay, so you only take falling damage if you butt stomp off of a ladder. Good to know. That sucks. Well, good night, bird catcher. Have a good one. Okay, so we've already killed the boss. That's... And we have... We actually have... A spell here. Well, that was effective. Whoop. That didn't work. Yet yeah, I forget I forget that butt stomping through platforms actually passes you through them. Okay, so what do we get? Heavy punches. I got the money for it. Or a lifesteal dagger. Oof. Well, you know what? Considering we're always going to be a heavy punch person anyway. Oh shoot. There we go. God, I hate internet issues. The number one thing that I'm going to have is like a criteria. When I get back when I like get my own place, probably at long last, is uh Google Fiber. Like 
If, if I ever go full-time on YouTube and, like, actually try and set up some kind of streamer, YouTuber type house, we're probably going to do it in a place that actually has Google, uh, Google Fiber, just for, uh, convenience sake. Hey, Vial. <laughs> Thanks for the compliments. I love it when people show up and just, like, you know, love your stuff. Ah, because I, I don't know. I, I will admit, I am the kind of person that really doesn't know how to handle compliments, but I will gracefully take them. Okay. So I got heavy punches now, which makes me even more dangerous, because now I got the knockback combo. Hoi! Ah, <laughs> God damn it! Fucking Dragon Slayer in the wrong freaking character. It would have been great last run, but no. Dragon Slayers are only for non-warriors. What kind of nonsense is this? Okay, well, whatever. I will just be a little bit salty on the inside at all times as a result of this. That, that sucks. Okay. Let's see. I'm just gonna let that happen. Let's see. Do I read? Oh, oh, viol. Yeah, Tower of Gun. Uh, Tower of God. Good manga, sort of. Mon. I think it's a manhwa actually. Except for the main characters, like, good. Fucking forgot about that. Ah. Uh, okay. So, seriously, cannot cannot do uh drop attacks. Not do drop attacks off of freaking, um... Okay, so that that is God Curse. We have no use use for it. Cannot do drop attacks off of ladders. I'm floored that they ha they actually did not fix that one. Okay, it is indeed a manhwa. Thought so. Okay, so we're in a little bit of a pickle. Just because probably should have put that rock in the middle of the spikes. Uh, hmm. Getting around this might be a little bit tricky. Missed that jump and we're dead. Okay, well, you know what? It's life. Now we're up to a lot more health than we had earlier. What do we got down here? Now I gotta remember, do not... Do not drop. Instead, Dragon Slayer. Continue Dragon Slayering. Dragon Slayer like your life depends on it because comically overlarge swords are the coolest thing ever. Ah, uh, yeah, I am having non-stop connection issues. Okay. Uh, back to the run. Looks like everybody can see. Should be able to see. Freaking internet issues. Okay, so do remember, do not, do not take falling damage from freaking ladders, of all things. Because that's the only way I can take falling damage at this point in time. Okay, let's get out of here. Uh, we've got heavy punches. We didn't go with a lifesteal dagger because we really didn't need it. Okay, perfect. Ah. Uh. Hey, Razgun. How's it going? You just barely missed me having crazy internet issues. God, I hate internet issues. They are the worst. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, this is actually looking... Look, oh, what the fu... Uh, okay, that's useful. So now we want CQC. Just one, though. Now, hopefully I don't drop any more frames in the next couple minutes. It looks like my internet's a little bit wiggly, but it's not terrible. We've also got the giant death sword, which honestly, for the wow, okay, for the most part, giant death sword's not going to be that useful. However, don't matter that much. Let's see. Uh, can somebody tell Adjusto and the mobile users in chat that I'm back up? Oh, you know, I never really account for that. The the mobile people probably get shafted in this regard. I should probably just punch things. I should probably actually just butt stomp things in the long run. Okay. You know what? Let's clear the rest of this level before I decide to go up that direction, because there's probably a whole... Hello? Whole sections of this map that can be bypassed. Yes! By butt stomping. And, you know, not going this way. Also, could just bomb that area. Very tempted, actually. Do not like having to deal with spikes. Okay. Whew. That just froze. Well, it doesn't look like I'm dropping it. More frames. Okay, that's gonna get really asinine. So we've got one really good bug working for us here. One really, really bad bug. A. Do not fall off of ladders. In fact, don't use ladders if if it can be avoided. Okay, so we've cleared out the entire bottom section. I don't have to deal with this again. Okay. So we've 
figure out the bottom section. Hopefully we won't have to deal with it again. I'm trying to punch freaking Biats is hard. Okay, let's crush the next one to death because mostly I can. Okay. Let me think. How am I going to do this? I guess if I scoot this over, punch this one out, punch it over so it's on top of the spikes, then it doesn't look like we've got a single anything over there anyway. Okay. And it looks like those guys went on some kind of crazy mystical vision quest adventure. Okay. So as long as I don't fall into spikes or do anything particularly stupid here, we've already pissed off the worm. This is an awkward place to fight him, to say the least, and I do not want to go anywhere else. Oh. Okay, I've never seen that before. I gotta be a little bit wary of poison. Fucking poison. Fucking poison. Goddamn poison. Okay. So that hurts a lot. Benefit is, I know exactly where he's coming from, so I don't have to plan him out too hard. Okay. So as long... As I'm just super, super, just like Heidi Holy. You have little to worry about. Just put the fire down. There we go. Okay, so he's down quick. Yep, fire really does wreck his face. Much faster than uh, most most other ways of dealing with the problem. Okay. And we can punch up. Unlike most characters, we actually have a vertical attack. I guess really unlike half of the characters in this game. Because I guess the warrior also has the overhead swing. Also gotta remember, I can punch things downward, too. Which, arguably, safer than, uh, butt stomping. Okay, does not look like I'm, I'm dumping any frames here. Ooh, cat, that hurt a little. There's a one. There's a two. Well, that was interesting. Interesting. So standing on top of slimes now actually does damage to you. Okay. Oh, that's fine. We've still, we've still got plenty. Oh, hello. Oh, we've still got plenty of useful things up our alley. So now we got double jump. I guess, yeah, Rogue can shoot up with his perk. See, the problem I, I have with the Rogue shooting up with his perk is... It's... It... it the, the way it angles is weird. And I never really liked that. Okay, so now, now we've got double jump. That gets us over a heck of a lot more things. Conveniently. Okay. So don't... Well... What the... What the... I'm not even on the ladder! God, I'm gonna kill myself this way. This is fucking stupid. God, I hate... I hate this bug. That is... That is an awful bug. And I'm... I mean, I'm glad I know about it. But at the same time, I, it is just not fun to deal with. Okay, so he barely stole money. What happened with the ladders? You missed it. Uh, so apparently there's a bug in this game now where if you butt stomp off of a ladder, you actually take crazy damage. Okay. Oh, shoot. Pork chops don't heal you. It just becomes an, it's a null item in your inventory. Oh, that sucks. Right, let's just drink one of these. Okay, so now we have no beneficial bugs. Honestly, this is probably going to be my last run with question mark, question mark, question mark until they fix this issue, just because it's such it's such a painful issue, and it's almost impossible to avoid. Okay, let's go with freezing aura over boulder protection. Okay, but yeah, now that is that is such a rough thing. Did I even check with the shop head? Come to think of it. I must, uh... Oh, right, he gave me double jump. I forgot about that. Okay, so we've got really good gear here. So while we're at it, we might as well dump some of it into this thing. You're probably not useful. I'm gonna get rid of the Dragon Slayer at this point. And the Bolt of Protection Helmet. Okay. So we get some miscellaneous crap. I don't know if any of it's good or not, but no. 
I really hope they they change butt stomps and ladders. Because that, <laughs> that sounds like an interesting shoots and ladders offshoot. Ah, because, yeah, it's just going to be really hard to avoid taking that falling damage. And I have no idea why it does that, either. It's fascinating, honestly. Okay. So get the shop right off the bat. Book of Heal, okay. Because it's it's not even it's not even butt stomping. It's not even it's not even butt stomping that's doing it. It's it's just simply letting go of the ladder. I wonder I wonder if that's actually a bug with everybody. I'll have to check that with like another character. I want to say it's with this one. Oh, but yeah, no, taking 13 damage after dismounting on a ladder, that is rough business. Oh, that's convenient. Thank you, Freezing Aura. Thank you. Thank you, Fire. Flaming Pillar. Alright, cool. So we do have we do have Mana Shield, but we also have Heal. Unfortunately, our intelligence is 3. Making this probably the least useful book in my inventory. I did it again! So here's the problem. I've got 100... And 10. Oh. Yeah, you can't hold down. You can't dismount ladders. That's the problem. It's not just that I've got this baked into my mind, which I do. I absolutely do. I've got this baked into my mind. That's actually w the only way of dismounting a ladder without actually going straight back up, which I mean isn't necessarily a problem, but still. There goes all my mana. That said, that's why I have it. We're going to have to drink another potion of regeneration. This sucks. Yeah, because it has... As long as you touch a ladder and then you do down A, probably with this character, it transitions into... You take fuck tons of damage no matter what... Like, what your plan is in life. Which kind of sucks. Kind of super sucks. Okay, so what do we got over here? Please don't be death and destruction. No such luck. Uh, so yeah, this is going to be a short run. Even though we've got... I mean, it's it's definitely one of our more overpowered starts. But because of bugs, I just... There's, there's not much I can do about it. Apart from, like, save... You know what? You know what we're going to do? It's going to be a short run. I'm going to see if I can uh, file a bug report. I'm going to see if I can find file a bug report. And, uh... See if they'll fix it by tomorrow. Probably not. Probably not, but it would be convenient. Convenient. No, honestly, we're probably just going to die here, if anything. Okay, so that's jump. That's magic mapping. That's teleport. That means I have next to no identifies. That's recharge. Oh. I have no in I have no scrolls of identification. Nope, I do. Okay, so we get a potion of speed, potion of defense, potion of feather fall. Let's drink speed and defense. Not that we overwhelmingly need them, but still. It's gonna help. Okay, so let's start by let's start by equipping the ring. It was marginally good at best. How the devil am I supposed to fight this guy? At least he's killed like next to everything in the area, which is kinda nice. But there's no... I don't have any ranged attacks. Oh, uh, I do have something. A little bit on the awkward side. Problem is, he's probably going to start rolling. Miss. Complete another miss. Okay, so there's one. So I have to be very careful about landing these. But it's probably going to be one of the easier ways of me doing damage to him. Okay. Oh, the 
changed it. Damn it. Alright, and do not... I don't even want to test what happens if I ground pound him while he's rolling. Okay. Oh, well that's what happens. It works. I don't die. <laughs> this is stressful shit. Got him. Okay. So, we've actually got a very very good anti golem boss move. It's just incredibly risky. No, I don't want to be in my inventory for this part. And I don't want to be stuck underneath a spider either. Okay, so we get some poison resist. Doesn't help me that much. Okay. So if I can get one intelligence by the end of... Uh... Nope! If I can get one intelligence after this one, or from an item, we're okay. Comically injured, but we'll be able to get our health back way faster than most situations would allow. Okay. And then what I'm probably going to do is actually save. After... Yeah. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to... We're going to... We've already seen all that there is to see. We're going to go back to the Curse Shrine, see if any of these are particularly dangerous uh, to use. Then... Unbounded Sight. That's almost good, except for the minus one intelligence. What about the boots? Nothing is cursed, apparently. Ooh, that's exactly what we needed. Huh. There's a slime boss in this game. Really? I have no idea where he would be. Okay, we get spike protection, which is really useful, but not right now. Okay. So we've lucked out in the best possible way. Cause now we can now we can learn healing. Start casting it. It barely heals us. But you know what? It's better than nothing. Let's see, so have I been to the treasure room yet? Yes I have. So save for trying to scum for some amount of magic stamina by like jumping the uh hey. I enjoy doing this. Okay. So that probably got me a heck of a lot more magic stamina. Let's get out of here. Okay, so apparently there's a new new boss on the first level that I didn't realize. Uh, and it's like a slime boss. That's cool. Okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to heal up here while we have some mana. It's not going to be much, but it's a hell of a lot better than dying. Do we just have like an insane amount of magic stamina here? We must. Weird. Do we just have infinite magic stamina? It feels like it. You know what? If we're like this, I could just continue this run. No, we are running out of magic stamina. <sighs> yep, that's the last of it. Could have scummed once. Oh well, not the end of the world. So here's the question. Do I save? And continue. I think I'm going to. I'm going to file that bug report. Hopefully they can do like a hot fix. Because I don't want to wait two weeks. For them to patch this. But I'm going to save. Preserve this run. Which is a beautiful run. That needs to continue. Unless the hot fix wipes it out. Which I really hope it doesn't. I have no idea. Well either way. I will be continuing this run tomorrow, one way or another. I'm just not... Oh God, I, I hope they fix it without wiping my save, because this, this run seems like it has potential to loop through New Game Plus for sure. <sighs> so either way, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Vagante, and as always, thanks for watching.